Hey what's up guys welcome back to the channel and it's your boy talented gamer here we are back with a brand new video this is week 6 of fortnite chapter 2 season 4 and uh, here I'm going to tell you how to complete the all challenges of week 6 so the first challenge is to search the 7 chest at weeping woods so you need to I recommend you coming at this tower at weeping woods weeping woods and uh, there will be mostly two chests over here you can open them and this both chest will be get counted and I'm gonna tell you a safe route to other chest now you see this east side of this tower now you gotta jump as you see this one more bridge over here now you need to jump or you can directly go down to the stairs now you need to come over at this location this house will have one chest over here so you can uh, tear open and collect and complete the challenge by this one and uh, the other chest will be one more chest will actually be available on to the bridge over here so till now we have actually opened four of them now from here you have to go to the main house at the weeping woods the big one over here so you need to go to the main house at weeping woods and you need to go directly to the second floor because the second floor has a chest over there you go to the second floor actually and there is one chest over here so this is the fifth one and for the sixth one you can go here over here and for the last one you can actually go to this house or to the top of this building there will be one more over here there you go you have completed your challenge and you will be granted 25,000 XP moving on to the next challenge challenge you'll have to land at uh, coral castle and here you'll have the challenge of collecting uh, stones from coral castle we have to collect 300 stones or gather 300 stone or harvest 300 stones from coral castle so as you can see there's so much of stone facility over here you can come and you can break over here and you'll have to gather 300 stones from over uh, coral castle that will grant you 25,000 XP and that is how you will be able to complete your second challenge moving on to the next challenge for the next challenge you'll have to come to retail road the next challenge is that we have to take a zip line from retail road to steamy stack so retail row is this one and as you can see there is current supplies over here you, there will be zip lines over here you need to take a zip line from over here till uh, steamy stack so this is how you'll be able to complete the challenge and that will grant you 25,000 xp same as the other challenges also and that will be one of the challenges from week 6 of chapter 2 season 4 of fortnite and this is also a easy challenge you'll have to take the zip line from retail to all the way to steamy stacks then only the challenge will get completed As you can see we are at the final zip line to reach at steamy stacks and that's how the challenge will get completed so let's move on to the next challenge of week 6 of chapter 2 season 4 fortnite so the next challenge is to deal damage after our knocking an opponent with black panthers ability shockwave kinetic or kinetic shockwave ability so as you guys know um, the ability of black panther is not yet available in battle royale mode it's only available in marvel knockout so it won't be available but i'll explain you the challenge you have to knock a opponent or an enemy and then you have to deal damage yourself 
with Black Panther's Kinetic Shockwave. And that's how you'll be able to complete the challenge. Moving on to the next challenge. Oh, we have a third guy. My aim is trash. Okay, there you go. Third guy eliminated. I think there's one more over here. What the hell is There you go. This is how you complete the challenge. Let's move on to the next one. For the next challenge you'll have to go to Slopey Swamp and the challenge is deal damage at Slopey Swamp. And you have to deal 500 damage to the enemy so that's easy but still you'll have to kill some guys so you just need to as you can see the storm skin going in front of me so I think I will be able see let's see let's see what is he doing oh here yeah, I'm gonna do it my heart oh hell no bro nah nah yeah aim is trash thank you very much so moving on to the next challenge let's go zoom 10 forage items at holy hedges so for that you can land either at this home near the garden center in front of the garden center this home has like cabbages so there are more than 10 over here like 15 of them so you can actually gather them and you can consume them when you have lost your health during a fight and if you don't get forage item from this home then you can go over to this home and they'll at the back there will be like 15 more cabbages over here so you can go to you can go there and if you don't find forage item over there also then you can go to the smallest house i'll tell you that house over there back side of the house so you can go there and uh, you'll be able to get 15 cabbages from there also so that's how you'll be able to complete the challenge and you'll be able to get 25,000 xp see there are 15 cabbages over here so you can gather or you can consume it if you have lost your health moving on to the next challenge for the next challenge you'll have to catch a legendary fish that is way too hard but not impossible so actually i was i was playing for three and a half hours and i was not able to find a fish so let me just tell you you need to catch a midas flopper and that's how you'll be able to like complete the challenge so that's all for this week let's see you guys in the next week and i hope so you have liked the video please like it if you have not share subscribe and comment and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching